Start lying on your back, knees bent, feet flat on the floor for some bridges. Take your band and hold it over your chest with your hands shoulder width, your palms facing towards your legs away from your face. Anchor your ribs as you reach your arms back overhead. Lift your hands. Take your hands towards your thighs as you roll your pelvis up into your bridge. Press your band down into your thighs, your thighs up into your band. And then from your breastbone, roll yourself down, anchoring your ribs as your arms reach overhead. Lift your arms, roll through your pelvis, pelvis peels up, band presses down with nice wide open collarbones, looking straight up to the ceiling on the center back of your skull. Arms reach overhead. Lift the hands, tilt the pelvis, peeling up, pressing up and down. Roll yourself down. Let's do two more, anchoring your ribs. Lifting your hands, tilting your pelvis, peeling up, pressing up and down. One last one. Tilting your pelvis, rolling up, pressing up and down, nice wide open collarbones and roll yourself down from there. Let's do some single leg circles. Put one foot in the band, reach the other leg out straight along the mat, hold on loosely enough that your elbows can be on the floor, bend your lifted leg just a little bit, then anchor your ducktails, you straighten the leg up to the ceiling, and bend, little bend, and straighten. Two more, keeping your ducktail, on this last one, keep the leg up to the ceiling, pull your abdominals in, anchor with the down leg, the foot that's on the floor, flex that foot, reach your lifted leg across your midline, down and around, pulling your tummy in. Stable pelvis, low abdominals on, two more in this direction, using the band to help you create a bigger stable circle, circle than normal. Go the other way. Hold your down leg and your pelvis still, Do one more circle and then change legs. Second leg in, first leg out, elbows down on the floor, head, uh, head on the ground, looking straight up to the ceiling. Soften your knee and then straighten your leg, anchoring your ducktail. And bend, little bend, and straighten. Two more. One last one. Finish with the leg out straight, active with the down leg, flex the foot, pull in with your abdominals, reach your lifted leg across, down and around, back to the center. Stable pelvis as you circle the leg. One more in this direction. And then go the other way, open, circle down and around, pulling your tummy in. Stable with the down leg stable with your pelvis. Finish up at the top, bend that leg in, put the other foot into the band too, ready for some frogs. Heels together, toes apart, knees apart, float your head, nod your chin, fold the ribcage into an abdominal curl. Check you have your ductile connection. Pull your abdominals in as you press your legs out and bend in, keep your ductile. If you need to make it a little bit tighter to have more resistance, you can. Press out, squeeze your heels, pull your tummy in, Anchor your duck tails, you bend your legs in. Scoop your tummy in, press. Bend in as much as you can while keeping your duck tail. Scoop your tummy in, press and bend. Two more, squeeze your heels. Our last one, stay with your legs out, come into parallel. Lift your legs up as high as you can keep your duck tail. Pull your tummy in, lower your legs away, scoop your tummy in. Anchor your duck tails, you lift your legs. Scoop your tummy, low abdominal strongly in as you lower. Anchor your duck tail, scoop your tummy in. Two more, duck tail, scoop your tummy in to lower the legs. Duck tail as you lift, scoop your tummy in to lower. Stay there, if you can, lower your leg all the way to the floor. Reach your arms out straight, scoop your tummy in. Arms pull out to the side and bring yourself up in a roll up. Arms reach out to the side, scoop your abdominals in and round yourself down, all the way down. If you want, you can cross your band over. That might create a little bit more tension for you or you can keep the band uncrossed over as you choose. 
Lift your head, scoop your abdominals in. Think about your head on the axis of your spine. As you go, arms pull out to the side, head slides back. Let's do two more. Lift, scoop, reach. Arms pull out to the sides, you work the back of the shoulder. One last one, on this one we're gonna stay up, scoop your tummy in, round forward, and then roll yourself all the way up. Walk your hands tighter on the band, knees as bent as you need them to be, to be right on top of your sitting bones, and back into the middle. Beautiful lift through your spine, palms face each other. Bend your elbows till they're level with your mid rib cage. Pull your shoulder blades up and onto your back and release your arms forward. If you want a bit more tightness on the band, choke up closer to your feet. Pull back, check that your elbows are level with your ribs. You don't want them forward and your shoulders, uh, you don't want your elbows back and your shoulders rolling forward. You want your elbows level with your rib cage and your shoulders on your back like dart arms. And release. Look straight ahead, nice long spine, head up on the axis of your spine, pulling shoulders on your back. A little work through your neck to hold your good head alignment. Work through your low back to hold your good low back alignment. Let's do two more. Shoulders on your back. One last one. And release. Loosen up a little bit on the band, just a little bit. Turn your palms to face down for a wide row. Nice lift through your spine. Pull your elbows wide and high to the side. Your hands are wide too. Your elbows are just below the line of your shoulders. And control it back. Head up and back. Beautiful lift through your spine with your rib connection. Right on top of your sitting bones. Both arms pulling. Just check that your elbows are no higher than your shoulders. Your hands come wide too. Let's do two more. One last one. And release. Cross your bands over. Again, holding on reasonably close to your feet. Beautiful lift through your spine. Knees as soft as you need them to be to be right up on top of your sitting bones. One, bend one elbow and turn and look over that shoulder. And release. Other side. Beautiful lift through your spine in the center each time. Two more to each side. Ready? Twist and release. And twist and release. One more to each side. Beautifully tall in the center. And release. We're going to do the teaser. If you prefer to just go back to the roll up, you can just do the roll up. Loosen out on your band. Palms face to the floor. Arms stay straight the whole time. Roll your marbles 12 and roll yourself all the way down. Lift your head, nod your chin, head on the axis of your spine, lift your legs as well, and roll up into your teaser. Chin is knotted lightly in, you're in a long curve. Arms pull out to the side, check your wrists are flat. Rotate your pelvis and roll yourself down. Lift your head, scoop your abdominals in, peel yourself up, squeezing your heels, pulling out with your arms. Scoop your abdominals in, roll yourself all the way down. Two more. Scoop your tummy and float up. Pulling out, roll yourself down, head on the axis of your spine, and scoop up one last time. Stay up, pull your tummy in, small lower of your legs, small lift. Spine stays still, arms stay still, pelvis stay still, your tummy pulls in only your legs. Move one last one, and lower your legs all the way down. Release from there, and we'll finish with a nice twisting stretch. One leg out straight along the mat. I'm gonna change legs so you can see what I'm doing with my arm. So one leg out straight, the other foot on your knee, cross that lifted knee over, reach your other hand out into a T, and look out at that hand. Now rotate your thumb to the floor, your baby finger to the ceiling so you open your chest more, and do little arcs of the arm up to your ear and back. A nice twisting stretch. And release from there, turn to the other side, pulling the knee across, other arm is out into a T, you're looking out at that hand, rotate the thumb to the floor, the baby finger up to the ceiling, and little arcs of that arm up to your ear, 
and back down. Do one more. And release from there. 